Okay, this is a little demonstration of what I call the smooth and easy CT testing provided by the CTMP 2020. I have it connected to a 2005 multi tap CT. So all I have to do is press ratio. The hotkeys do both ratio and saturation. I want to save it to the SD card. I'm not. This is this is illustrating a case where you are not connected to the internet. You just had your $15 router as a local network, and uh, you know you were doing this completely isolated. Okay. Just press hot two because I know it saturates over 200 volts. And uh, then I have to do absolutely nothing. I could be landing the leads after I measured the previous CT or making a wind, doing a winding resistance test on another CT or having a coffee break or going to lunch or whatever I want to do because the test set will test the CT fully automatically. Now doing the X1 tap. 2005 on that tap says 2000.12. You see the, uh, the color of the LED on the front there uh, is the color of the jack that's energized at the particular time. Right now it's doing the X2 jack. You see the X2 is 1600 to 5. It's turned green, it's doing the green tap. No lights are lit, no indicating it's doing the black X4 tap. Which is 500 to 5. It has now completed all the ratio tests. I'm going to do the saturation tap test on X1 through X4. The red light is lit because the red jack and the red wire is energized. And it's doing this without any intervention from me. I'm not doing anything. Ramping up the uh, voltage, taking voltage and current readings. It says sat, it's now saturated. Test is complete, plotted the graph. Now proceeding to the blue X2 tap, I'm going to draw a saturation on that. Slowly ramping up the current voltage to get accurate readings.
Okay, it has uh, completed the test. It is uh, d downloading some heading data from the internet, but you would have to type that in yourself in the case of no internet. And the uh, test is done. So, what I can do now, go to the main menu, hit the aux button, the screen takes a little bit to update on this screen, this kind of stuff. Uh, start the FTP server. FTP server is running, so let me just go over here to the PC. Launch the file viewer. Press the FTP button. And bam! All the data from all... I can just tab through the ratio. Ratio and sat, ratio is underlined. Saturation data for the uh, X1 tap, X2 tap, the color is the same as the color of the jacks, X3 tap, and the X4 tap. I want to see what, you know, it's a log log graph, a little bit compressed, I want to see exactly what the current voltage is in there, bam, I click my mouse on there and it says I equals 0.055, V equals 338 or whatever. If it was a three phase test, I could look at the other phases, but it's not, so I, I can't. I can enter a note here that will appear down here once it's saved in a file. And uh, it's, it's that fast. This is a single CT, but it's that fast. At the point where the, uh, it exceeds the IEEE saturation point, the voltage readings turn a dull red, turning a brighter red at the IEC point. That's how smooth and easy it is to test a CT with a CTMP 2020. It's just awesome. Thank you for watching.